anymore. Let's take a look back at how this drought kind of evolved here in southern New England. It really began in late May, early June in eastern parts of the state, and then we didn't see much rain at all through the middle of the summer. And by mid-August, we were in a severe drought in eastern parts of the state, and almost all of the state got into at least a severe drought level into early September. But since then, the drought basically diminishing by October 1st, significantly reduced, and now we are not in a drought at all in parts of eastern Connecticut. There still are some patches of western areas that are in what's considered to be a moderate drought, but now that we're getting out of the summer, we're firmly into the fall and headed toward winter. We're in the time of year where rain and precipitation in general will be a little bit more widespread. So even in those areas, things should start to improve. And they already have. Look at the average monthly rain in May, June, and July. July, each of those three months averaging about three inches of rain. Well, the most recent three months averaging about five inches of rain each. So the deficits pretty much have been wiped away. Even going back to January 1st, we're now in a slight surplus or basically close to average for the year. So enjoy the nice weather that's ahead. Don't have to feel guilty this time. Back to you guys. All right.